You ready everyone welcome to another OBS tutorial on this channel. In today's video I would like to show you how you can add Warriors custom browser docs such as Twitch chat or your activity feed into your OBS studio. So let's go for it. Okay so let's say that you started your OBS and you don't want to actually open your web browser as well and all of the other stuff in case you want to stream. Let's say that you want to have everything at one place. So for this in our beginner guide I already explained to you how docs are working in the OBS studio and that you can turn them on or off how you prefer up here at the docs but in case you want to add something new something what is not originally in the OBS you can go once again to the docs and then you will click on custom browser docs here basically you can create any custom browser docs that you want in case you got URL to this here as you can see it wants from me doc name and the URL doc name is basically you can call it how you want you can call it chat tweet chat or whatever else in case of course you want to add chat so in my case I want to add chat so I will call it Twitch chat. Let's say that I would like to add more chats in the future for Kick or anything else, okay? And of course, it works like this for the Twitch, for Kick, for anything else you want to use it for. So I will write here Twitch chat and then I want to put here the URL for my Twitch chat. Where can I find it? Good question. You will simply go towards your Twitch dashboard or Kick dashboard or whatever else you are using. So we will go to your dashboard. And then here you can see all of my creator dashboard okay my activity feed my preview my quick actions and my chat so let's start with the chat let's say that we want to put our chat into the obs for this you will simply click on those three dots at the top right corner of the chat window so not those top three dots but the top three dots of this like chat window so right here and then you will click on pop out chat and as you can see the pop out chat will pop out actually and you can move it and put it anywhere you want but in case you don't want to do this every time and you want to put this pop-out chat into your OBS, you can simply click on this URL address like this and you will click on Ctrl plus C or right click and copy. Now we are going back to OBS and I will click here towards this uh, like big window with the URL and I will click on Ctrl plus V or right click and paste of course. Now I will click on apply. But of course, as you can see, in case you want to use it, you have to log in first. But don't worry, it's completely safe. So I will just log in and I will be right back. Okay, so now I'm logged in. And as you can see, we got our Twitch chat up here in the OBS. It's already not pop-out window, but it's actually dock, which you can move and place wherever you want. So in case I want to put it right to the scenes, I can. In case I want to put it right to the preview, I can. Like this and voila it's already set there so in case i will turn on obs next time my preview will be in the mid and my chat will be at the right i don't need to go towards my dashboard or anything else in case i would like to use my obs for the recording only and i don't want to see here my twitch chat as there will be nothing what would happen actually because i would be offline so i can simply go to docs and i will click on twitch chat thanks what it will uncheck twitch chat here and it will disappear from the like normal obs as a dog but of course now for the purpose of the video i want it back and let's say that we want to add also activity feed into your obs here watch out in case you want to add any other of the windows from your dashboard you want to start with your twitch chat because the twitch chat is the only window that will require from you your login towards the twitch so in case you want to use your activity feed in your obs you want to start with the twitch chat because otherwise it will not work properly and it will not show your recent activity of your twitch channel well so as i said in case you are trying to do this custom obs studio doc setup start with the twitch chat now as i said let's say that we want to add the activity feed towards the obs studio as well we will go towards the docs custom browser docs here i will write activity feed like this and then we want the url once again i will go to dashboard three dots at the activity feed of course so three dots pop out copy the url Control plus c back to the obs Control paste and apply and voila activity feed right in the obs studio let's say i want to put it left next to the preview and it's easy as that you can put there anything you want in case you would like to manage your rewards on the twitch like this you can once again click on manage rewards request and then once again just copy this url and with all the others browser features towards which you got your url link you can use it like this okay ladies and gentlemen that's all for this video really hope you found it what you were looking for hope you are good and video fine thanks for watching and all of the support and see you all next time